Booker T. Miller sent me a message, and he was like, Sim Nation is up, baby, and I had absolutely no idea what he was talking about. But attached to that was a video of this. It was uh, the Michael Jordan video. Somebody had gone through and painstakingly edited this edit of, uh, you know, of Michael Jordan, uh, uh, of likeness in the wreck, doing his thing, and this thing was going crazy. I, I thought it was just a regular edit. I didn't even realize it was on overtime at that time, so I didn't understand the implications of how big this really was. But when something makes it to overtime and it has 3.8 million views, it's got to be more than big. We're going to talk about all that in one second, man. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video, comment y'all thoughts down below. Y'all already know what we're trying to do. We're trying to go to the moon, Alice. And listen, one more time, as usual, we got the Breeze Tees site. We're going to have this gym rat up today. We're going to have the gym star up today. So make sure y'all check that out, man. You can do your own custom t-shirts, man. We got all types of stuff. Lockdown University, we got the locked. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. Pull up to the seat. But anyway, if you have something, you want something custom, man, check it out. It takes less than 20, 30 seconds. Look, we got the back to school joint, right? Boom. You go in, you're gonna, you're gonna size it up. Bow. Put it on the shirt, and then you're just gonna add it to your cart. Same thing with the hats, man. Go in there. We got mouse pads, custom mouse pads, everything, man. Make sure y'all slide by Breeze Tees, man, because that site, you know, that's that's my site. Uh, and we do t-shirts, we do custom everything, breeze tees, custom things, all that good stuff, man. But back to what we're talking about, man. Like I said, bro, then here we go right here. This Michael Jordan edit got tons of views. People are loving it, people are digging it. And what I'm realizing is that the people inside of the 2K community versus the people outside of the 2K community, it's amazement and astonishment, right? We're gonna watch the whole thing or what have you, but uh, I wanna show y'all something bigger that happened that uh that i i myself wasn't even aware of and that is this joint made it to sports center espn i ain't seen no i don't think i ever seen unless it was like a double alley or a triple alley or something like that i don't recall really seeing 2k clips or edits making it to espn and this guy says he made an incredible Michael Jordan edit. Look at what they, this is This is the casual people, man. These are the casuals that are saying this, because you know, I know the 2K, the 2K heads, they're gonna be, <laughs> I boxed that shit. You know, it is what it is. We're gonna talk about that in one second. But anyway, it says one person, this is a, okay, awesome. Is this a real video game out right now? This dude don't even know what 2K is, man. What are we talking about? Like I said, we know the casuals are, are the biggest part of the community and that's who they're trying. These are the people that 2K is trying to capture. They're trying to capture those dollars because they already got ours. Uh, then, then up next, they got to say, the amount of time this must have taken, one, make the Michael Jordan step. Uh, step two, use the Michael Jordan package and trademarks. Three, search for videos to create the package in the first place. Four, the video editor. And then somebody says, hire him at this point or point him in the right direction because he clearly is doing something right. Listen, man, these are the things that the people who are, like I say, the casuals or what have you, they want to see this stuff. They're excited about it. This is the stuff that people want to see basketball, poetry in motion, things that, that you can actually do with the thing. I think even the devs are, would probably say, you know, we could say the devs even probably feel the same way. This is what we want to be displayed with our basketball game. And I think that's why the Mazda zoom, 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 the, you know, the Mazda zoom, zoom, back and forth play style, they never really showcase that anywhere else. That's that's prevalent in the 2K League. I, I, feel, I really feel like they're working to try to eliminate that as much as they humanly can. But, you know, it is what it is, man. We are, we're humans. We're going to find a way. You, you put a system in place, we're going to find a way to break the system and make it be as efficient for us as we possibly can. That's just how it goes, man. But it's just crazy because the amount of love that my man is getting versus here we, I mean, let's see, let's see how long it takes for somebody to say, hey, somebody says, no cap. Uh, and like I said, these are always going to be the cap. I said, no cap. A Kobe Bill did me in yesterday just like this. And then the next comment, here we go. Would it fly in Pro-Am? Tell OG to stay in the wreck. Bro, why does the hate have to come so soon? Nobody cares. This dude made a, it's like your kid making an art project and they're showing off what they did. And then somebody say, well, that ain't Pablo Picasso. So he just need to put the paint down right now. Bro, are you, shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Let this man do his thing. He ain't bothering nobody. He just put out an edit 
that he enjoys and he wants people to see and other people are clearly enjoying it and the crazy thing is the people inside the 2k community are the ones that are more worried about it than the people outside the 2k community people outside the 2k community or the sim nation or whatever you want to call it man look they came to, they came to my man defense they says it's content and already got more views and reach than most people posting pro-am laughing emoji and then dude says dude said he just said you hear me and then uh here we go dude says uh awesome they said awesome oh, what is it awesome yo whatever awesome amigo here the, here's the video blah 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 save the link i don't know what he's trying to say we don't care about that hey here we go we just got some more um man these people trying to trying to advertise their stuff nobody care about that hey he said dude said why am i emotional this is what the 2k devs dreamed about reggie jackson tipping his hat you know what i'm saying he tipping his hat what have you and he say he said hold on now he get all the jordan shot celebration animations i ain't i ain't see him in the store he got all of them what have hey like i said man this guy is good this is what people are saying about it. they want to know what the song is sim nation made it to overtime not just the overtime but the espn this is how brown shirts see themselves at the <laughs> The music doesn't match the gameplay, but the editing is fire. See, this is the main thing that people are talking about, man. It says, I like to see, uh, I like, I feel like I've seen something like this before in earlier 2Ks or what have you. Like I said, man, he getting mostly love and all of that stuff right there, man. So, so it's just like, I don't understand, like, like I said, I don't understand the hate or what have you, but it is what it is. But like I said, to, to, to this fellow specifically, they were responding and they just said here one person i knew it was coming hey flirting the wits flirting the vitsky says cap hey this is the main thing that people that people are saying that i really 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 respect if you if you say uh, somebody says that and you reply to i hope this is the right button we do not care Hey, it is what it is, man. He says, we do not care. Nobody cares. He says, yeah, because, uh, what did he say? Yeah, but yeah, because all y'all do is triple team it in the, in triple, triple team and reach. Wow, that's that's crazy. One dude says, Pro-Am wouldn't fly, don't care. And then the other person says, you know, we just going down here. Says, you Pro-Am players are just upset that y'all don't get this kind of shine. 2K community is full of haters. Yikes. That's crazy. And he says, neither would the Carl Malone clone with the dribble taking charges all the time. I don't know what he's trying to say. Pro-Am actually has no comp at the moment because Rick gives more rep. Man, that's, that's an interesting take. I ain't gonna say all that. Uh, literally no one cares. This is what I will say. Literally no one cares. I'd rather play like this and have a social life. Dang, that boy cutting deep. And then, hey, it is what it is, man. But you got more to that, uh, you know, uh, hey, well, hold on. What did you say? What one of them said? Uh, MS will be two and twenty-five in pro-am. Hey, it is what it is. He says, ain't none, ain't none of y'all hating, uh, hating cheese heads can make it to overtime. Hey, that's I, I can dig it. Uh, dude says, you sit in the corner during pro-am and think you're. <laughs> You sit in the corner during pro and think you're caught while while this dude is out there having fun, bro. I am dead. <laughs> the boys be talking. The boys out there talking that shit. But listen, man, you can't be. I can't let you talk about the corner boys, man. The corner boys are always ready. He gonna be ready to shoot that shot. Now don't get it wrong. And he said he will cook you. He will cook your ass. <laughs> Most of you proclaim self-proclaimed pro ams comp suck. Period. I ain't gonna lie about that, man. Like, like it's a lot of good people in pro am. It's a lot of ass dudes in pro am too. That's just sitting in that corner. How like, like I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Like, the main guy, the main guy, the center power forward and and the point guard. Not anybody could beat him. But a lot of them other guys, a lot of dudes. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep it 100 funky. A lot of y'all are in there masquerading as a corner boy, just sitting there chilling. And 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 then I'm on the top team. But you, know, you ain't the top guy on the top team. That's why it's always like when you lose to somebody in, in a comp situation. Why is it always the dude that didn't have no damn points and no fucking points or uh, rebounds, no no stats? That's the one that always messes you. The dude, the point guard, the center, and the, the power forward that really did the work, and or, or, the, or the two guard that really did work and that really did cook you, they never send no messages. It's always the person that didn't do a goddamn thing 
that's always gonna send that message. That's crazy to me, man. But it is what it is. It's not about that, man. Nobody says that this is the most competitive style. Nobody's saying any of that stuff. The only thing he's saying is, I'm having fun. I'm putting my edits out. They're getting traction and that's it. And I, I feel like a lot of people are jealous or hating because they feel like I'm playing at the highest level, which is not the highest level. That's the 2K league, but I digress. But I'm playing at a higher level and I'm not getting the shine. Listen, there was a point in time where y'all think I'm bugging. In the early 2000s, the NBA had some of the lowest ratings of all time. And there was a time when the, the playing, people playing basketball at the highest level was not the most popular. It was and one mixtape. Yes, those guys could go out there and do the exact same thing that and one did and all of that stuff. You know, they, they are that good, but hey, it's not winning basketball for them. But you didn't hear them coming out there shit on the uh the and one mixtape they was like we fans of it we love it we know obviously that's not winning basketball in the nba but but we love it and uh hey maybe some of the anytime they were asking like hey maybe some of them guys could play they know damn well none of them dudes can play up there except for alamo alamo or uh or uh, AO, AO even had a trial. They, he was the best of them. A lot of them guys had trials, but they, you know, they just weren't on that level. But they didn't care because they were getting paid and they had tons of fans and even Professor still doing his thing right now. So you see what I'm saying? So like, it's lanes for everybody, man. I just don't understand why we got to feel like you got to try. And when somebody does something and they're digging it, we always got to try to crush it with, you're not doing it at the highest le level, but nobody really cares. Anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Congratulations to that guy, man. He made it to not only overtime, but ESPN today. And uh, I ain't seen too many people do that. None of the cheese dribbling or any of the other stuff, the most competitive way to play the game, blah, blah, blah. Yakety schmackety, uh, you know, is what it is. Hey, go to Breeze Cheese, buy some shirts, man. Holler at your boy if you need something special. And I'm gonna holler at next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, AKA Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Guys,